This is example number two for factoring trinomials with a lead coefficient greater than one. We're gonna factor the trinomial 12x squared plus 14x plus four. The first thing that I notice is that this trinomial has larger numbers. And when I factor any trinomial, really the first thing I wanna do is ask myself if it has a greatest common factor that I can factor out. So when I look at this trinomial, I notice that 12, 14, and four are all divisible by two. So I can immediately factor out a two, and I'm left with six x squared plus seven x plus two. So all I've done is factor two, and I'm gonna leave that two out here. I'm gonna keep bringing it down because I can't lose it, but right now I don't need to worry about it or do anything with it. Okay, so right now we're going to focus on this trinomial. This is the trinomial that we now need to factor. And it still has a lead coefficient greater than one. So I am gonna use the grouping strategy to help me to factor this trinomial. So in order to use that strategy, I need to find my magic numbers. So I'm first looking for a product of six times two which is 12. Remember, it's the lead coefficient times the constant. So I need a product of 12 with a sum of seven. So I need to find two numbers that I can multiply to get 12 and add to get seven. You could write down all the factors of 12 and then you notice that these are both positive so both of your factors are gonna be positive. So this becomes really easy. I just need to find the two factors that I can add to get seven. That's eight, and three plus four is seven. So my magic numbers that I'm gonna be using to set this problem up in a new way is three and four. So now I'm gonna take this trinomial I'm gonna bring down the first term exactly the same, but I'm gonna replace this middle term with three x plus four x. Three x plus four x is still seven x. So I haven't changed the value of the trinomial. I'm just rewriting it in a different way. Now I can use my grouping strategy because I have four terms. So I can group my first two terms together and I can factor out a three X and I'll be left with two X plus one and I'm going to bring down this two so that I don't forget it. And then I can factor my second two terms I notice that I can factor out a positive two and I'm left with two X plus one. Now notice that I have common factors of two X plus one and when I factor out that two X plus one, on this side I'm left with three X and here I'm left with plus two and I can't forget to bring down the two that I already factored out. So I end up with two times two x plus one times three x plus two, and this is the factored form for 12x squared plus 14x plus four. Notice that the factored form has three factors, and that's okay, that means that this is completely factored and cannot be factored any further. Okay, so again, just remember to first see if you can factor out a greatest common factor from the beginning. Then use the grouping strategy to factor the trinomial if it has a lead coefficient greater than one. Okay, that completes our videos for this particular lesson.